What is up YouTube? This is Jim with JimLopez.com. In this video, I wanted to do a review of Word Hero in 2024. Is it still worth it with the emergence of OpenAI's ChatGPT and a lot of the other AI tools? I wanted to circle around and make this video to talk about Word Hero and to see if it's still worth it in 2024. So without further ado, let's get started. I am here on the Word Hero website and Word Hero is an AI powered content generator. Um, I made several videos in the past, but like I said, I wanted to make one in 2024. So right off the bat, I'm just going to talk about pricing. So they have two different uh, pricings. They have the monthly where you can uh, pay monthly or annually, and they have two um, different plans here, the creator and infinity, and it starts for $49 a month. And with this one, you get a lot of the, uh, generate unlimited content and as you can see here they have uh you can do up to 10 brand voices and i'll go into the actual uh, word hero in a minute but i just wanted to show you this one but what i really noticed recently is that they their lifetime uh deal they're not going to have it for too much longer so um i'll put a link in the description if you're looking for the lifetime deal they have two different plans. They have the lifetime starter plan and then the lifetime pro plan. So with the uh, lifetime pro plan, plan, you get lifetime access to generator and editor. You get unlimited standard text tokens every month. You get to do three brand, brand voices, which I'll go into in, in a minute. And um, they also have the enhanced gpt4 so i'll talk about that in a minute but i just wanted to do the pricing real quick uh because their lifetime deal here they still have it it won't it won't be around forever but um, this would be something to consider so i'm gonna go ahead and log into the word hero account so when you log into word hero uh, you come up to this home uh, dashboard and it still has the traditional uh, templates where you have everything from business related templates, marketing, social media, writing tools, and miscellaneous. So right in here, they still have all of the different templates that you can use. It just makes it real easy to where if you were writing uh, a food recipe, you can easily create a food recipe, everything from if you're doing a uh, Quora poem, you know, if you're doing Amazon product descriptions, you can do them here. So they have, they still have all of the different templates that you can use. So instead of uh, having uh, to write, you know, to cre create a description, you can easily uh, use one of these templates and easily create, like I said, everything from Amazon products. So what they recently did is they have the standard mode and they also have the enhanced GPT-4 mode. So you can click on here and go from uh, each one. Um, I'll go into the editor in just a minute, but I do want to show you that they also have the chat and they also have art. So, um, like I said, if you just need something done with the template, you can easily go here. They have the chat. I'll go ahead and click on that. So with the chat, they have a wizard mode and you can start asking questions. Uh, it's right here. It says, hello, Jim. I'm Word Hero, you're writing assistant. So I was messing uh, around with it earlier. And um, right here, I said, write me an outline about the benefits of eating healthy. And it said, sure. And it started asking me questions. And like that, it was able to gather some information to where you can um, finally was able to create the actual outline. So by answering these questions, it, it ended up being a custom outline. Um, so you can use the chat here, like, uh, you know, to answer any, any of the questions and they also have the art and same thing. Like if you're writing blog posts and you need, uh, art for your, for your blog outlets. So these are some of the images They came out pretty good. This one right, right here. Um, I just said, write uh, or generate an image of a person typing on a computer. And these were the images it provided. So the, they're still good quality images. And then um, let me go ahead and go into the editor. So this is for long form content. And um, let me see here. Let's go back. 
before I do the editor, I do want to show you something else. Um, so a lot of these, one of the things that makes uh, a tool like this different than just using uh, GPT is you want uh, you want to be able to create a brand voice or a certain type of, uh, of tone of voice uh, and keep it the same all the time. So let me just go ahead and go ahead right here, a blog paragraph. And you can create a brand voice and you can add it to anything that you're writing. So um, they have the ability to where you answer some questions. Let me go ahead and click on that real quick just so I can... Um, show you how it, you would set up a brand brand voice. You would click uh, give me a name. So you would put your name, describe your brand voice, and then you can actually also upload a writing sample. So you would put that uh, here. And then anytime you wanted to write, you can use, the, use this brand voice. So if you have different websites, you can create it based on your website. So every time it writes, it's kind of cohesive on the writing and it keeps everything the same. Um, so yeah, you can use this uh, on most of these templates, but you can also use it inside of the editor. So with the editor, they have different um, options. So recently they also made some changes to where you can give specific commands. So right here on top, you have a command mode where you have it write a specific command and then you can continue having it write paragraphs. So first you would create the outline, you would you would copy and paste the outline into here. And I'll give you an example, um, let me see here. This were, these were some of the articles I was messing around with today. Um, so this was the benefits of eating healthy. So from the example earlier where I had the chat create an outline, I was able to come in here, paste the outline. And as you can see right here, I just did the first part and then I'll show you uh, the way I do it is I just go ahead and uh, highlight a section. So I just want these three bullet points to be uh, written. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit uh, right here uh, for it to write for me. And then I give it a, a few minutes or a few seconds and let it run. And as you can see here, it starts writing each section. So physical health benefits, one of the most captivating aspects of maintaining health. Uh, let me see, it moved it. Uh, I wasn't able to write, uh, continue reading because it moved it to the next section. But as you can see here, that quickly, it wrote this next section. Um, and then you would just go uh, down each section. So of course, if you want to add more or you want a specific, you can go right here, like I said, a command and you can uh, ask it to write a specific uh, information. And then I'll go ahead and give you an, uh, an example of another one I wrote. Let me go uh, click here. So this is another one I had uh, it write. This is a free AI paragraph rewriter. So this one right here, in a matter of a few minutes, it was able to write 3,369 3, words. And as you can see, I did the same way where I just uh, paste the outline that created and then i just have it write each section and again you can choose from the uh you can switch to an enhanced mode which is the gpt4 and then of course if you needed images for this um article here you can have it created through the through the art um so they continue to make up the upgrades um you also have the ability to add keyword assistance where you can add uh, keywords so that when it writes the article, it can automatically uh, add those keywords. Um, they have this new thing here that's coming. This is the Word Hero Advanced Writer. Um, I believe it's in beta. So yeah, it would, it would uh, add a little bit of information and it would write the article. I haven't messed with this yet. But like I said, I just wanted to give a review, an overall update on Word Hero. So they do continue to make upgrades to um, this AI tool um, with, like I said, the emergence of ChatGPT, OpenAI. Uh, is a tool like this still worth it? Um, in my opinion, I still believe it's worth it if you sign up for the lifetime deal. 
uh, that's what I had. Like I said, over over the years, they've made all these changes, and um, I reg- I originally signed up with the lifetime deal, and you can, like I said, still take advantage of uh, this tool. You know, you pay once and you get to use it, and as they continue to upgrade, you get to take advantage of all the upgrades. Um, when it comes to monthly, I guess it really would be up to you, um, for the, let's see here. If you did do monthly, you can still generate unlimited content. Of course, for the enhanced mode, there's a certain amount that you can use. And overall, like I said, this is the word hero. Uh, if you just want to give it a try, I'll put a link in the description. I also put a link to the lifetime, uh, deal. If you want to support the channel go ahead and click on that but like i said either way if you want to just give it a try see what you think but again thanks for watching and i will catch you in the next video